hey guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is oxy thank you guys for tuning in um so today i have a zara haul it has been so long i did a zara haul for you guys i just picked up bits and bobs a bit of basics here and there there are not a lot of pieces in this one zara prices are not smiling again zara is not the zara that i used to know back in the days these days 300 euros can probably just buy maybe two three items from zara like it is ridiculous the prices have spiked up and yeah so i haven't really been going crazy in zara anymore i just always try to buy pieces that i know will stand the test of time and are versatile meaning that i can always wear them over and over again i try to cut down on fast fashion because there's always going to be something new there's always going to be another trend all that you're losing is money because you just have piles of clothes which i do have and you just keep buying and buying which is really not good and it's not sustainable but anyways for the purpose of this video i wasn't really impressed with a lot of items that i saw in zara but there are just some bits and bob that i picked out that i really wanted to show you guys let's start from fragrances because that's the main the main the main thing so i picked out two fragrances from zara the first one being moonlight whispers which is supposed to be a dupe for the kayali pistachio gelato something 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 i don't know what the full name of that fragrance is so i've heard a lot about this fragrance i've seen reviews on tiktok i've seen reviews on instagram people raving about this scent a lot of people really love the Kayali one only that their issue or the major complaint that I've been hearing is that it's not long lasting so obviously I don't know if this is as long lasting but I do know for sure that it smells amazing it's definitely not as expensive as the Kayali one you know I think it's about $75 or $80 thereabouts for 50 ml but there's a dupe. I've not tried the Kayali one, but I heard it smells amazing. I heard it smells nice. If you do not have Kayali money, you can definitely get this one for a fraction of the price. It has pistachio, it has cardamom, it has pink sugar. This actually opens up very sweet. If you're not careful, I believe that the pink sugar really does a lot. It really plays a lot in this one. It's really, really sweet. I can't even lie to you guys. It's really sweet. But I think what I really enjoy with this fragrance is the dry down. So the reason why I'm talking about this fragrance is because the dry down is very gorgeous. Yes, I do not like sweet fragrances. And yes, this fragrance is very sweet. But the dry down is a little bit more on the creamy side. It's a little bit more on the sultry side. It warms up a bit as it dries down on your skin, which is what I love. In the dry down, the sweetness is a little bit toned down. So you don't get really nauseous it's not headache inducing if you don't like sweet fragrances you might not really like this one because yeah the pink sugar is really pinking it smells a little bit like candy to be honest yeah i think this will perform more in winter in spring in autumn or when it's raining because this i think is just a little bit too sweet for summer or when it's very hot our weather here is very bipolar so <laughs> there are days where it's going to be cold there are days where it's going to be hot but i'll definitely be reaching out for this when it's cold when it's raining when you know it's a little bit chill maybe summer nights as well this is actually very stunning also a very good layering fragrance for other fragrances in your collection so the other fragrance that i picked up here is the red temptation tobacco the packaging is not that serious so it just comes in this packaging here so nothing too serious this is a 50 ml actually i didn't know that i thought it was 100 ml wow this is a 50 ml this is a tobacco flanker so there are other ones there's the bloom honestly i have completely forgotten i don't know the names of the other ones in this collection a lot of people raved about the tobacco one a lot of people spoke highly of this fragrance i actually didn't smell it in store i think the first time i smelled it i really couldn't tell the difference between this one and the other ones honestly i just went by popular demand or, or popular review or popular opinion the moonlight whispers is about 8500 foreign um I don't know what that is in dollars but this one is 10k so this is almost 11k for 50 ml but then again this is extra the perfume this is supposed to last way longer than the other zara fragrance i don't think that zara has come up with any fragrance that is extra correct me if i'm wrong so this is probably the first one which is why it's probably in 50 ml i think the bottle is stunning the atomizer is fairly okay i would definitely be reaching out for this a lot more i think i love the dna obviously it has that baccarat rouge dna but with a little bit of 
twist because it's a little bit smoky i do get the smokiness from this one because of the tobacco of course but it's not so much it's not so smoky this is why i can barely tell the difference between this one and the other one so moving on to the clothing item so i picked out basics right i saw this crop top which comes in this what's the name of this fabric again i always keep forgetting the fabric which is the popular bodysuit fabric i'll just call it the popular zara bodysuit fabric crop tank tops in different colors i think the first one that actually caught my eye was the pink one but they just didn't have my size that was actually really stunning like hot pink which i think is very cute so i picked up this one in black it comes in small medium and large so i picked this in a size large it is really really stretchy so i wasn't really scared that it wouldn't fit i also picked the tank top in brown in a brown color i like the fact it was pretty affordable because what i did notice from the fabric from the previous ones i got from zara is that after a few washes a lot of hair start coming out so it becomes very rough and worn out so i like that it's not so expensive to be honest again i picked both in size large and this was 3295 what kind of <laughs> conversion rate is that well yeah 3k it was just 3k so it's pretty affordable you can easily wear this in you know in a blazer as a camisole you can wear this on its own especially in this hot summer you can definitely style this with a denim shorts blue jeans black jeans anything this can go with literally anything in your wardrobe so like i said i'm into versatile pieces i'm into pieces that can style differently i can wear on different occasions in different ways and different shapes and different forms and i just really like the way it fits on me i'm going to leave the try on on the side for you guys to see absolutely gorgeous stunning piece so the next item i picked up is also a bodysuit but i love the fact that this actually has an adjustable strap which is why i picked that up it comes in a v-neck if you know me i'm a fan of v-neck forever um yeah this is a bodysuit also the same fabric it is a little bit double not padded but double layered so you don't really have to wear a bra with this one i actually picked this one because i really wanted something i could wear in blazers i could easily just throw on an over shirt on this one with the denim short and i'm good to go it's very versatile again it comes in different colors but i got this in black it comes in brown i believe and it also runs in small medium and large so i got this in a size large very stretchy as well and this was 5595 so not too expensive as well and i think this will actually last long and stand the test of time this can be styled differently i really needed items like this the next item i picked up was this oversized shirt which i'm in love with so if you know me you would know that i just love my shirts because i don't like to think too much when it comes to dressing i don't like to overthink it except i'm going for a special occasion then yeah i would plan 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 outfits but for a regular schmuggler day i just like to throw on something very comfortable still stylish but very comfortable first of all it's a very nice yellow stripe shirt i want to get this shirt in every color because i just think that is an item that i can definitely style in different forms in my wardrobe with shorts with trousers i can wear it on its own because it's really oversized and it's really long i can definitely wear this as a dress on its own even with the tank tops or the bodysuit i can just throw this over shirt on it and it becomes a whole different outfit i actually love this i have so many shirts like this to be honest but i don't have a shirt as oversized as this because i literally got in the bigger size so i got this in extra extra large and i'm really petite so this is really really big on me i'm going to leave you know a video of how it looks on me i got this in a size extra extra large and this was 10 more or less 11,000 foreign which is typical of zara to be honest i wasn't surprised that this cost 11,000 foreign but the main thing that actually attracted me was the color because i really like the bright yellow color i think it's perfect for summer it just screams fun happiness you know yellow is just a very bright and bubbly color which i I really love so yeah the next item i picked out is a trouser i was even surprised that this actually fits and it fits very well in the sense that i don't need to actually tailor this trouser like it's not too long it's the perfect length this i got in size extra large it runs through to extra extra large but i got in size extra large and this was 12,000 foreign very inexpensive i think it's typical of zara i believe this is a linen fabric so it's not really cut in it might have its matching top i just picked it up on its own 
own i don't have anything like this in my wardrobe and it's not too long it's not too short it's just the right length and i absolutely love it so the last item i'm going to show you guys i told you guys it's a quick video the last item i'm going to show you guys is this um should i call it jogger pants because they're not really joggers but they have this drawstring here so it kind of gives you that like jogger feel but it's not really a jogger fabric it's a tailored pants it also has zip on the side if the waist is a little bit big for you you can always still adjust the drawstring here actually what attracted me was the white thing there was a time where those pants that you could fold and then the inner white part of the pants were showing that was a trend at some point i liked the trend at that time i didn't think it looked good on me to be honest so Finding this one, I think it's really stunning. And I like the contrast with the white and the black. It also comes in a brown color as well, which I'm definitely gonna be picking up. I love how it fits on me. Secondly, it is not too long, it is not too short. When I say Zara is just surprising me with the sizing and the length, did I grow taller? I don't believe so. This definitely is the right length. I'm so surprised. And there's nothing that indicates maybe this is for short girls or this is for tall girls. There's none of that. It's just normal pants. I love it and I think this would pair very well with like the tank tops, maybe an over shirt as well, even a blazer. I think everybody needs a black tailored pants in their wardrobe. I'm definitely going to be picking it up in the brown color as well because I don't have anything like that in my wardrobe. But yeah, that's all for this video guys. Let me know what you guys think. If you like more Zara hauls from me, then make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Leave some comments, some nice comments in the comment section so I know that you guys actually like this video. If you're not subscribed to my channel make sure you hit the subscribe button like this video of course share it to your friends and your loved ones follow me on instagram my name is opsy underscore p thank you guys for watching this video and i'm going to see you guys in my next one bye guys fantastic beauty loud without any sound i hope you don't let me down came and changed the dynamic show the sink like titanic i'm loving what i have found i hope you don't let me on you, only you, in a sea full of women only you can do, only you can do, everything about love is a full gamble, but from your sample, all my pride in the mud is a dismantle, I'm a full cancel, the way you do it so clean I'll be down for the flex, you cold as the ice on your neck, you just gotta drop me one line one text, and I'ma switch plans I'll be there one sec, I said you know me, low key, OG, Seconds, Snapchat, story We gon' last long, you never could bore me And I'm never gonna do you like what you would you call me? Cause the magic Girl,